pirate, but I long to be sailing by the stars across the seven seas, living with no earthly cares, my mates and me, the envy of a worldly man who are not free. Good day. I'm Samuel Von Siegel, owner and captain of the schooner Pursued. We are an 18th century privateer living history museum ship. Our goal is to create a place for educators and students of American history to come get a first hand look into how our forebearers sailed during the late 1700s and helped form a nation. How will we accomplish this, you might ask? Simple, the schooner pursuit. She's a good, strong vessel, a prime sailor. She's 65 foot long from stem to stern. Her beam boasts a width of 20 and a half feet. She's a 62 tonner and her masts tower into the sky, 75 feet. She's an old vessel. She's aged 38 years and she has sat for far too long out of water. We need your assistance to make her whole once more and bring her home so that we can fulfill her destiny. She does need a bit of work though. Our shipwright is very confident and tells us that for a vessel her size and age, she's not that bad. It looks worse than it is. She has had some neglect over the years, but it can be fixed. It is not too late for her. We've had estimates in the $250,000 range to get her completely fixed and tip-top shape with the museum and the charters in full operation. Aye, tis a fair bit of coin to be sure, but that amount would cover everything from preparing her from where she now sits in St. Augustine to move her to a restoration site where we can complete the repairs and at that point we bring the crew down. And Once that's done the crew will sail her from the restoration site up the eastern seaboard visiting the historic ports along the way creating a buzz getting the world to see her once more. And at that point, we will enter the Philadelphia Harbor and then on to her birthing dock along the Delaware. It's quite a venture. It's an opportunity to become part of a civilian merchant privateer crew for a little bit of a time. It's not something you see. There's not a lot known about privateers of the Revolutionary War. Help us bring her back and bring back a piece of forgotten American history. Thanks for your time. I was once a young lad sailing by the charts. I did not save a wind nor water nor admire the stars. Now I have grown old and frail and do not journey far. I only long to sail the seas once more to find my heart. Well, come aboard and boys long we make for our naff shores. Ride the stormy seas with us, you'll find that soul of yourn. Leave your wealth behind you and your bitter soul. Make your home with slaves and sinners, then you'll be reborn. You are your heart.